welcome to yet another video today i'm coming to you with a fashion video um i really feel like i've been finding myself in terms of fashion and obviously i'm going to bring it on to you guys so today i have um a little video where we're going to be styling a white fur jacket this has been my favorite winter garment and i recently just posted a reel on it so head over to my instagram to see like a little snippet a little snippet of this video this is just like a longer form video where i'm going to give you guys a little bit of um tips styling advice here and there i know it's visual but like there's some other things that i think that you guys should know so here she is so, this is the star of the show for today it's all about her let me give her some space let me give her space so that y'all can just take her in so this is um the jacket that we're going to be styling i got this from mr price uh, it's a beautiful white fur coat for a jacket. Why do I keep on saying coat? It's a beautiful white fur jacket as you guys can see and it's got this elastic feature Which is my favorite that just snatches you up in the waist uh, The same for by your wrist here. Yeah, it's just a really cute jacket and goes along with so many, so many things Well, not so many, but yeah, it goes along with most things So yeah, let's get started. So this is the first look you guys um, I went with a classic black and white situation um, as you guys can see, I've got the black jeans and then I've also got black boots. These boots are just above my ankles. I got these jeans from Mr. Price as well. These boots were gifted to me by my cousin, so I don't know where she got them. And then I said little tote bag, boom. You got <laughs> I feel like you guys should just know at this point that when you see me, you see this little fashion week, okay? So yeah, this is the full fit, you guys, and just to come a little bit closer, um, I'm sitting on a speaker, <laughs> but yeah, I I just paired this look with plain studs, and I think that that's today's first tip with this outfit is that when you're wearing your earrings, you must be very mindful of your hair. I was gonna wear long dangly earrings, but I realized that I've got dangles down my face, so like that was just gonna clash and it's gonna be a little bit too much and also somehow take away from the outfit but yeah this is the first look so this is look number two for look number two as you guys can see we have this beautiful sultry sexy full dress this is a full dress yes but look how cute that looks with this jacket right? so i paired this look with this brown it's brown it's not brown <laughs> with this gold clutch um to match the earrings i'll come closer in a second but then yes and then i also said boom right lace up heels because coordination because balance the combos must what communicate at all times so yes here are the earrings that I paid with this look. I did so to match the clutch and then also coincidentally matches my nails as well. <laughs> so yes guys, this is look number two. So how do we rate it? How do we rate it? This dress is giving, okay? Like little booties matter, little booties matter. <laughs> but then also look at this guys. I, I really want you guys to understand the power of this elastic band down here. Let me just put my bag down real quick. But this elastic band, right? I just had a meal, okay? I just had a meal. And if I were to rock this dress as it is very tight, very form fitted, this would be me. And my full belly. But look at that. What waist? What waist? You see the illusion that this, this elastic like, snatches your waist so much because. Um, this jacket is very puffy so the puffiness of the jacket um, and this is kind of like contradictory to each other so that's why you have that illusion whereas this dress is just form-fitted if you didn't know that now you know so what do you think about this look comment down below and then also and then also style tip is here when it comes to lace up heels and then um if you have a dress on like this you see first of all this dress is very long it's below it's almost to my ankles it's below the knee way below the knee because my knees are like here but then when it comes 
comes to lace up heels and if you're wearing them with a dress like this you see how I didn't crisscross them but rather I just kind of um, tied them and made a little yeah you guys can see what I'm talking about I, I, I'm not very familiar with these terms yet but then you guys see what I'm talking about it's advisable for you to use this method instead of the crisscross just so that there is balance between like your legs so that also it doesn't it isn't too much because another thing you have to keep in consideration is that this jacket in itself and and since it's the star of your outfit like the, the focus needs to be here so if you have like a little too much going on and then also this dress already has ruffles down the side, it's just going to be too much so this is like a more simple approach to this entire outfit and just adds balance look number two what do we think So here we are with look number three, another very casual situation. We just said mom jeans and white sneakers. I feel like you guys should have seen the white sneakers come in. I mean, it's an obvious combo. So for this look, blue bag and then jewelry. Oh, I need it for. I have these little white and gold hard earrings on. Really, really cute style half up half down i i was not in between my ages today please don't come for me but yes style tip of not for the day for this look style tip for this look is ladies please invest in a blue bag because when you're wearing blue jeans it's just easy to put it it just matches automatically with your blue jeans so this is something that i learned very recently and i'm surprised that nobody really said this or even if they did i just never really got it but then if you're also like me and you didn't see blue bag blue jeans done like the theme is white and blue immediately uh, black would simply just kind of throw off the look a little bit but blue blue cohesion balance exactly guys i'm a libra so balance 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 <laughs> keep that in mind oh yes before i move what do we think out of 10 very simple very cute not too busy. And then also, I have this look on my Instagram as well, just that I styled it a little bit differently. If you haven't seen it, definitely follow my Instagram. Look number four. What it do? What it do? Mm, mm, mm. I think this is my favorite look out of everyone that I have on this video today. Isn't this so cute, you guys? Uh, I got these flare pants from. And I got them pretty recently, so I think that if you go and store these today, or you can check online, I just like to say, please don't be fooled. These are long. I just folded them up because I haven't yet taken them to a seamstress, but it'll do for this video, I guess. So yeah, um, again, we have the white sneakers because coordination, because combos, because balance, exactly. And then I just paired this with a backpack because <laughs> this was this is the only brown bag that i have okay and plus it still fits it still fits this looks like a very cute campus fit like if you know that you're gonna cross paths with your crush i think that we that we pleased to see like this but dress for yourself first period even if you're not gonna see your crush but earrings oh i need to i need to start swatting more as well serving hairstyles on this video as well have you, have you peeped have you peeped give this video a thumbs up if you have peeped I'm, i know you see me <laughs> so yes out of 10 personally i'd give this a perfect 10 because what so cute is it because i have a thing for these pants and like i just like them because they're new maybe maybe not who knows or maybe it's just because it's like a really cute outfit left foot then right foot then left foot i'm trying not to move too much because it's gonna come undone look number five what it do look number five is for the conservative baddie the modest baddie the chill baddie not chill this is more conservative classy 
ladylike. Do you know what I mean? Do you get what I mean? Come on, velvet. Come on, hip wrap. Okay, so these are those same lace up heels. And wait, I just got this black and gold bag from. Where did my mom get it? I'm sure she got it from Legit though. But yeah, um, cool earrings. The set of earrings is so nice. Like, I cannot get over them. Um, I obviously bought them um, when I was going to go to the fashion show. Again, if you haven't seen that, please go watch it. Babes, and I, I, I specifically wore these earrings because I wanted to match my bagel. <laughs> That's where we're going with this outfit, okay? We're going to church. We're going to church with this outfit. We're going to a funeral to like probably like if you want to go meet your mom's boyfriend, I mean your boyfriend's mom, and you want to make a good impression, just pull up with your Bible and she'll know what she. <laughs> I'm joking. Or am I? It depends on your boyfriend's mom. I don't know. But yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> but yeah, this is look number five. What do we think? And then also, I like saying also, man. Um, I hope you guys were able to pick up two of the styling tips that I, I mentioned previously. Again, we have the dangling hair pieces with the not so loud earrings and then lace up heels. Because this dress is slightly shorter, it's just below the knee, it leaves a, a lot of space here by my legs. Then I can lace it up. Because again, this dress is very simple and it's it's quite plain so the lace up i mean the crisscross the lace it up adds something to it you know what i mean you guys people like me though yes here is the next look um we said skinny jeans boot heels heel boots and then the black bag to match uh, I did a longer strap because these jeans are giving a little bit more of a casual vibe. This is like a semi-casual vibe going on here, hence the hairstyle as well. Um, earrings, you said those hoops yet again, but it's giving business lunch. No, it's giving chilled business lunch on a Sunday after work, after church. Yes, after church. So after church, it's the previous outfit and then you're just like, oh! A girl is booked and busy. I've got things to take care of. Still with the same jacket, jeans, bag, boots, restaurant, period. What do you think about her? Uh, do I have any styling tips for this look? Um, no, not necessarily. I think this is a pretty standard look. And this is the last outfit of the day. Another dress, another ladylike moment. I know I already said that other outfit with the brown pants is my favorite but i think this might actually be my favorite simply because i mean i, I really don't i really feel like i don't have to say why y'all can really see uh we have the white heel these are my only white heels you guys so and plus they go with everything as you guys can see like everything that i've um shown you guys so far you've already seen and with that said the last styling tip is guys please wear your garments you guys are going to see a whole bunch of these garments in the future so much for me but you're going to see them as different outfits um wear your stuff wear your stuff you bought them so that you could wear them please let's just destigmatize this thing of oh my gosh you're repeating clothes repeating outfit. oh we've seen those you've seen that dress so many times you've seen those shoes many times if they can be reusable if they can turn and morph into different outfits please i'm gonna wear it and you y'all about to be still gonna be these shoes especially because the is always coming <laughs> but deets details details like i said or did i did i say this but i got this dress from acronyms and i got it in the kitty section this is a size 13 to 14 if not 14 to 15 petite girls worldwide they dress these kids nice ne? <laughs> but okay Jewelry, I want a little ham with the accessories, but I have this beautiful neck piece that I got from the chip, I believe. I've got these cross earrings that I've got from the fix and this little clip that I also got from the fix. And then we have this bag from a long, long time ago. This was from an online store that is it is it still running? Central Boulevard. I don't remember. I don't think it's still running. 
this is the final look. What do you think? Oh, and the reason why I put this here with the other dress as well is because this is a summer dress, right? But then sometimes during the springtime or during like autumn, like you go to places and it gets chilly and you just wanna, you know? So yeah, this is my favorite. Rate. that is it for today's fashion moment guys i hope you guys enjoyed it i certainly enjoyed making it you will definitely not be seeing the last of me in this fashion space darling do comment down below which one was your favorite look like i said mine was the green dress i've made up my mind i know i was like uh, but it was a green dress for sure i really hope you loved this video share it with somebody who you think might need it um it doesn't specifically have to be a jacket like this maybe something similar or maybe you've been looking into buying this jacket winter is not yet over well wait it actually is it's september now yeah but like you guys know how unpredictable the weather is in the southern hemisphere and like you can re-watch this next winter as well if you come across something like this anyway again i really hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one